Okay, testing this out in the fine quality mode to see how it does. And I've also got it in shutter priority. So I'm gonna test out, right now it's got 60 frames per second. And uh, of course when you lower the shutter speed, you get, uh, oh come on you piece of crap. Then you just, okay, when you lower the shutter speed, you add light, but of course it makes it more blurry. Right now I've got it at 30, so I'm just going to zoom in here and see how it does. This bathroom is really dark, and this screen looks so nastily pixelated, I don't know what it's going to do, but anyway, I'm going from 30 to 15. Now you can see it's kind of blurry, but uh, I'm going to take with 15, come into mom's room, and test it out with complete darkness to see what we get. It's pretty bad. Let me throw it up to eight. You can go all the way up to eight. I guess that's the fastest you're gonna get. So really not much you can do with that. It's so blurry. So let me just go back up to 15 then back to 30. 30 looks like it's pretty good. Still maintains pretty reasonable frame rate. <clears throat> come around here and uh, just see what the room looks like go back up to 6 or 15 looks like that it's kind of blurry though you know then we go to 60 and uh, it's darker definitely darker <clears throat> so 60 looks okay in normal light but if you want to go into anything darker like this room down here this is what 60 looks like. And I go to 30. So you can see what 30 looks like. And of course, if you zoom in in the dark, it's going to be really dark because the aperture gets bigger. Let me go to 15, and it's a lot brighter, you can tell. But of course, everything's going to blur just a bit. And then I'm going to go up to 8. You can see it gets much brighter and go back down to 15. This is the hallway. I go to 30. It looks pretty good in 30. I'll probably keep it at 30. It's grandma's room at 60. Then I go to 30 and then 15. Now what I'm going to do is I am going to stop.